One more discard remains, huh? Discard. I'm howling at the moon. Um, let's... Sorry, let's move on. How do you know that song from My Little Pony? I've never seen My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, but I have seen a video of a guy... Must have been 2010, 2011 at his high school talent show made what I would describe as an inadvisable decision to sing one of the songs from the show by himself on stage. Did he own it? I guess what I would say is he did not own it in the sense that I mean, he believed in what he was doing. He had 100% confidence in, in what he was doing. Brother, this just makes sense. This makes so many sense, it makes a full dollar. That guy's probably making 250K a year now. Oh, no doubt. He, he has a skill that like only he himself on planet Earth has access to, for sure. There's no doubt about that. He's smarter than I am, there's no doubt about it. He probably wins Friday Night Magic every week too. That's not meant to be an insult, but it's also not meant to be a lie. Does he have a cane? I don't know, librarian, just leave this poor guy alone, okay? I watched the video 10 years ago. I don't remember the exact specifics. Why, why are you asking me these, like, like I'm being deposed right now or something like that? I'm about to lose Imbolatro. Like, it's just, it's too much. It's too much. I'm about to win Imbolatro, man. It's just... I don't recall. No! Oh! Okay, well, slash marker me. I gotta go to the bathroom. I still don't know if it's the right video. Okay, here's here's what I remember. I feel like he has the... And I don't want to... I'm not dunking on the kid. I just want you to know it's the right video so we're not dunking on two kids, okay? He's got dark hair. I feel like he has Rivers Cuomo's haircut. The camera is like pre-smartphones having great video, so it has a little bit of like an 07, uh, like 2007, not a salute, a 2007 video quality. And he is holding a cane, if I remember correctly, and he's like spinning it around and he's jumping a little bit, going, Discord, we're howling at the moon. You know what I'm saying? I think you just watched the one you he linked. It is this one, okay. <laughs> You're, no, don't say we found him. You found the video. I hope the guy's chilling. I'm just saying that was the reference. I'm merely bringing it up as the reference, okay? Discord! I'm howling at the moon. It's, it's sleeping in the middle of a summer's afternoon. Discord! Whatever they do to make you take the world's way. Discord! Are we a prayer alone? Or are we just a stepping stone to take you back? This poor guy, I, I mean, if anything, like, I feel bad because, like, you know, I specifically don't have a moment that embarrassing for my high school career, but, like, if I did, at least I went to high school to 02 to 06, nobody was filming that shit. It's gone to the, the only thing it exists in is our increasingly decroted memories, right? But now kids these days, they get embarrassed. Like, there's an embarrassing moment in high school, and then they got to, like, answer for it the rest of their lives. Wait, what were you thinking when you got up on stage and did that? Well, I was fucking, I was 15 and my brain wasn't fully developed yet and I made a mistake. I took, my, my most embarrassing high school moment for sure, I was, I had hair in high school. It was in university that I shaved it off and I had like the Lance Bass cut. And then um, I got like color hair gel. So when you put the gel in, it would like put neon color in your hair. And I got a white hair gel. And then I, to this day, I couldn't even tell you why I did it, but I just, it was just like, it looks cool. And then like on the side of my head, like here on my hair, I just put like a white line here and a white line here. And then I was like, that looks fucking sick, bro. And then I went to school and as soon as I got on the school bus, Everyone was like, what the fuck did you do to your hair? And it was like, shoot the bus driver, like shut the door. And the bus pulls out and you're like, this is going to be a long day. <laughs> and I got roasted from 
7.01 a.m. till like 3.30 when I the bus dropped me off and opened the door. And I washed that shit out and threw the hair dye in the garbage can. But at least it wasn't immortalized in a video where it's always like, look at this dude, look at this dude's hair. And I'd have to, I would be like ninth grade and not know how to deal with that kind of attention and be like, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I just thought it'd be funny. <laughs> oh, man. So anyway, I think like if anyone ever, you know, you're an adult now, someone brings up like an embarrassing moment from when you're in high school, you'd be like, yeah, I don't know. I was in high school. What do you want me to say? Like I'm not Mike Glambin versus Raindrop in my real life, bro. That was just like four years when I was in a, a brick building prison. We've all got embarrassing moments, I'm sure. So if anything, we don't bring it up to insult the person we bring it up to share in the trauma of very confidently doing something that is overtly embarrassing with just a little bit of hindsight none of us in high school were embarrassed at all yeah well listen my my demographics have changed probably half of you spent three quarters of your high school career in remote learning environments which is not your fault but like you miss out on that formative experience of being insanely cringe Graduating pre-08 feels good. You thinking you're slick? Typing pre-08 when obviously you fucking graduated 07 or 08? <laughs> it was 08. Yes, I know, I know, okay, obviously. Then you didn't graduate pre-08. You graduated 08, brother. Listen. What happened in 08? This dude graduated. <laughs> 